It is about 2 a.m. I can hear a distant vehicle driving. Where are they driving? Where are they going, I wonder? What are you doing? I wonder what you're thinking. I wonder what you're feeling. Or rather, how you're feeling. I'd plan to say so many different things in this audio. And then so many different things happened. But I knew that I had to do this audio. I knew that I had to have this sacred time to speak with you. This time during which I express myself I'm going to chat a little bit about beauty. Perhaps I might talk a little bit about dreams. And then I'm going to finish with a sleep preparation meditation. Can you hear that noise? There is some She may come in and interrupt my audio and then I'll stop and speak with her and then continue. Ah, another girl. At this time of night there have been so few girls here. I always create in my mind a story. I love the action of breath, apart from the fact that it's essential for life. It's so calming to breathe in through your nose and out through your nose. It's 
so stabilizing as if somehow the action of breath reminds us that all else is somewhat trivial. When we bring our life back to the breath, life has perspective. Okay, let's begin my gentle vlog about beauty and a preparation for sleep. So sit down or lie down comfortably and we will begin. Can you hear the smile on my face? It's a big smile. Ah, the breath. There are so many noises here, so many night noises. I enjoy them. Today I watched a YouTube video by Tabby Cat. Her name is Tabitha. Somebody sent me a link and I watched the video and I loved it. I watched every single moment. It's funny, I'm almost an old woman. Tabitha spoke about beauty, and as I watched her, I thought she was so beautiful. With her animated face, her smile, the movement of her head, she spoke about so candidly, so straight to the point about ASMR and her perception of ASMR. She was so funny, such a natural talent. What I loved so much about the video was her description of beauty and real beauty. You must, must watch it. You must take time to watch it. Just look up Tabby Cat. I'll include a link in the description. Oh, there's so much noise here. So many different night noises. There is something very funny about me trying to do any videos, really, with my life. My life pulls me in so many different directions. And I allow myself to be pulled. Children do that. Their needs pull me, and I am happy to follow. Another car. Beauty. As I grow older, my perception of beauty is more authentic. I used to be so focused upon appearance and so concerned about my appearance. Now I grow older. I have lines under my eyes. and other signs of aging. And somehow the world looks different to me. Nothing like the way it used to. 
Now when I look at her face, I see the brightness in the eyes. I look at the behavior rather than listen too deeply to the words. What is the consistent behavior of this person? How many people have they been kind to on many occasions? How important is it to this person to be liked? How focused is this person upon ego? And that is beauty. Beauty is the color of the soul which is reflected through the eyes. That is beauty. All skin ages, dries up, wrinkles, but the light in the eyes never dims. That amazing soul which shines out through the light in the eyes. We are animals, and as animals, we cannot deny that we are attracted to aesthetics. We are attracted by what is perceived by society as beautiful. We are animals. There's no sense denying that. It's just a fact. The irony is that we can fight against that or rebel against that. So even though we're animals, we can still, as spiritual souls, as spiritual souls, we can learn to see into the soul. And we can learn to see into the You know what the eyes are, don't you? The eyes are the window to the soul. The eyes allow us to see into that person, into this spirit. Beauty is not what someone looks like. Beauty is the behavior of this soul. It's not what they say, it's not who they know. Beauty is repeated behavior that does not ask to be known, does not ask for media coverage, does not ask for thanks, it's repeated behavior. Beauty has no expectation. We're all fallible. None of us are truly beautiful. But it is our journey towards beauty which matters. And it's our recognition of our own lack of beauty. It's very important that we're aware of our beauty because if we're not aware, if we don't have confidence in our beauty, we are not able to impart our beauty or give to others to pay it forward. It is not an arrogance or a pride that's required in our beauty. It's a humble knowledge a quiet understanding of our various gifts of beauty, what they offer to people and how we can benefit. Tabitha is beautiful. She added to my day to day. She was funny, wise 
assertive and somehow lifted me so significantly in my day and I just loved it, I really did. Beauty, beauty is so individual, such subjective perception. Beauty is never, ever, ever objective. Nothing, nothing, nothing can be labelled as beautiful. It is what we see. And what we see is so coloured by who we are. So tainted by who we are. Our development. So we each wear our own pair of seeing glasses and beauty is filtered through these glasses. We all concern ourselves at different times with what is beautiful. We wonder whether we are beautiful. We wonder what is beautiful and we wish to be near beauty and we fear being away from beauty. <laughs> the funny thing, I'm smiling, almost laughing. The funny thing is we have the power. We have the power to create infinite beauty. All it takes, all it takes is Turn away from negativity. Turn away from negativity. And feel compassion for anyone that's negative. And it is the act, the act of feeling compassion and empathy, which makes us beautiful. And it is the decision. opens us up to beauty. 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 In the eye of the bold. Let's let go of our attachment to beauty. Let's let go of our need, our need to be beautiful. Let's let go of our fear of being away from beauty. Let's just decide, decide to give beauty, to see beauty.
time to relax now. Ah, oh, another car. Can you hear it? It must be about 2.30 now a.m. I should go to sleep, yet this time is so sacred. Relax now. Just relax now. Just relax now. Just How does that feel? Did that feel relaxing? Do you agree with me regarding my views on beauty? Relax. Relax. Well, 
You are a guy. You are a guy. I am here and you are a guy. You are safe. I'm going to let you go to sleep. I really enjoy this time that we speak. Everything is quiet now. Everything is quiet. Quiet. Sleep well, my friend. Sleep.